It's cracking boys and my ladies, it is Ren Creator today. We do Sorceress, Selian's quest line. So first things first, you're gonna have to make your way to the Waypoint Ruins. Um, I do recommend having Rhea Lucarian, um, Grim Library unlocked as well for this quest line too. But we're gonna make our way over down here. We're gonna have to fight a pumpkin head boss. It's a single lone pumpkin head. Um, I will have a video out on how to beat these guys pretty easily, but just a single lone one. He ain't really too different from any other enemy. Just go ahead and kill him. He's a single lone one. He ain't gonna be too much of trouble. Once he's down, you can go through here. Open up this gate. Bloodborne style. You'll find Sorceress Selian. I want to learn sorcery. Yes. Not in thought. They can buy her sorceries if you so please. She sells some pretty easy ones. If you're a sorcerer coming here first, you'd be able to pretty much obtain them really easily. Since Pumpkin Ed's literally not that much of a dealio when you're going to fight, um, or when at the beginning of the game. Especially if you keep your range, it just keeps shooting spells at her. But now we're asking about Quinstone Sorcery after we bought one. So, once you've done that, you have to make your way pretty far into the game until you make your way to the Hermit Village, which is all the way in Atlas Plateau, so... Alright. So I went from the... Not the abandoned coffin, but I went from the abandoned coffin went up here. Now we're going to make our way all the way up. Make way over here in the water of the race. Nice. Watch for the young geyser. Don't worry, it's worth it. If you do some pretty damage, though, it's good to get to watch out. Just run around them. Or maybe we'll see if we're in this ad. Where's that checker? I'm going to jump off my actually really quick. Boosh. I believe I should actually cross you in this one, actually. Kill you. Kill that's the first, because they will build this up. And we'll build this up, because it's not 100% sure. You want to try that for 100% sure? Here, just to let the person leave. Somebody <laughs> Oh, that's a genial machine. Don't beat that. I don't want to go on a right now. Fight later. How long have you been smashing right here? Should I in here? I don't know what you're all doing We're almost there to get in there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you dare try to fight Snow's Great Hammer! I know who I'm fighting people. Jesus Christ, you want to fight some of those great heroes? Go! I'll take socks against them. Where's my, um... What's going on there? I didn't get the heal. Alright, whatever. Yes! Shut up. That's more like it. Frostbite's way, come back to the way, don't worry. Give me all the content later, don't worry. Stupid bear got my PP. He's real loud. Oh, I can do that. Wait, is that a bear? Yeah, it's a bear. I don't know why I thought that was a worm for something. If you just take a follow-up, go ahead. Just up the grease and then we'll be done with you. Shut up, don't And we have made it at last to Hermitville. Hermitville is... Hit up this grace and right here is our boy. Um Unfortunately, he is dead, so we're gonna take the comet Azur. Now we will show her this amazing sorcery. Saline seal breaker is ours. 
Celia Hideaway, thankful if you guys actually have a video on how to get there in my crystalline summon video, or actually how to get some of the most legendary summons of the game videos, so check that out real quick. But for anyone who isn't aware, the, um, not where the catacomb, silly. Celia Hideaway is right over here, right underneath Fort Faroth. You can get there very easily, just by going down and making a little V. So you are going to have to hit an invisible wall to get here. So now we're here, I'll teach you guys how to get through this area really quick, so... You have to hit a few invisory illusionary walls. Hit that up. Strike damage is really good against these guys. If you have a hammer, go ahead and take advantage of it. Luckily for me, I do indeed have a hammer, but. And badoosh. Okay, I'll get some balls hammer in the other video playlist, so make sure to check that out. Anyways, we're gonna make our way all the way down. No. There's going to be this sorcerer here. He's going to try to kill us, so we're just going to kill him. Examine, use our key. The douche, we are in. And there he is, we will talk. Stars of Rain spell is now ours. Oh, from Giant Blue Head, come back and talk to Celia. Or Celine. A Starlight Shard, not bad. Alright, so now we will go there now. So. Almost there, down here. Which main ruins. And oh my goodness, surprise boss fight. Oh boy. Take care of the boys first. Before you even try to- I mean, actually, they should be able to kill. Yeah, they should be able to kill him too. Thankfully, since it's grounded, we can actually use our ice to just completely destroy it. So yeah, check out the video again. Definitely worth it. This build's crazy. And anyways, once it's down, you can head down without any problem. Open up Bloodborne style. Ambush shard. Selene's Primal Glintstone, and now... Never mind, rise. To do, you can here. This place right here is going to be covered up. Just have to attack, just jump attack right here, and this place will show. And yeah. There we go. Place it in. Back at the Witchbane Ruins. Freya Lucaria Grand Library. You're going to make your way out here. And outside there should be two choices with two signs. We could either challenge Sorceress Selene to obtain her um, headwear. Or we could come over here and assist Sorceress Selene, which is what we're gonna do. So, we're gonna have to fight Bootleg Slave Knight Gale. Poor guy, just getting completely spammed by freaking spells. This is all I need to do to beat you. Bloody Vinger Vanquished. We have obtained Slave Knight Gale set. And gesture set put together. But now we're going to come over and talk to Celine. Yeah, Grand Archive, which you guys are going to notice is that um, the Queen is still here. Renala ain't going nowhere. But if we take a look see to the right, what on earth has happened? Well, first, we'll take the item. 
which is Glintstone Crown, and now we will talk to Selina. If you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure to leave a like, especially if it was helpful and this guy was able to help you get through to Selena's quest line. Also, make sure to subscribe to the notification bell for more editing and your content on the channel. Also, make sure to hit me up on your email list so that you guys never miss when my videos drop with some extra notification there too. Also, make sure to check out my other socials for more extra bits of content as well. And make sure to join the journey through the lands between by checking out the Odin Ringer playlist, which will be down in the description below. Until next time, rise my fellow tarnished, and brandish thine Elden Ring.